Hey everyone, it's Lindsay. Welcome back to my channel. I have a lovely flip through for you today. Four different journals. You may have seen these on my YouTube shorts over the weekend. Um, YouTube is, is trying to tell us creators to do a mixture of regular videos and shorts. And supposedly, they're telling us that starting next year, they're going to pay us or we'll get some kind of compensation uh, for doing shorts. Whether that will be worth it or not, I don't know. But I do love shorts myself, and so um, I'm trying to give it a little more of a try. But of course, you need a for real flip through of these journals because you need to be inspired. And um, of course, if you want to purchase them, they are available in my shop, nevermorecreations17.com. This is the first journal, and I love how the artist, which it is Michelle Wynn, one of my favorite um, artists, I love her work. And this is not her typical. A color scheme for the front of a journal. So I love that, how I get to be uh, inspired a little bit differently by her. But look at how she made this fabric look old and um, even I love the inked wrinkles and everything in it. So you have a lovely cover, three signatures. I mean, just look at how she aged that. Isn't that beautiful? So this is called Trash to Treasure. Look at the paper, the stamping handmade. Uh, I'm trying to see. She used ephemera from Leah Wilkins, Tracy Mathis, Joanne and Michelle, which they're all suppliers. If you haven't seen many supplies in my shop, there's two reasons for that. One, most of my suppliers uh, haven't sent that much since we've switched over to ephemera folders. And those who have um, are waiting to be shown, you know, I've been working this year. And I will have more time uh, come some of these school breaks coming up. Next week is actually a break. And hopefully we'll get to, to showing more stuff. So thank you for your patience in that. Um, it just is what it is. You know, you got to do what you got to do type thing. But I'm here. Nevermore Creations is not going anywhere. And I hope to continue to grow it in the future. Look at how beautiful this is. Just you can tell the little little cutouts and the little bits so pretty joy journey i love how she went with uh, such a neutral color palette if you followed my channel for any length of time you've probably seen me flip through her journals in the past uh for example this is one oh no i can't pick it up <laughs> i was going to show you one of her journals but it's actually sitting on the um holding my curtain up for filming and if I move it then that'll be a problem so but you've probably seen how bright and colorful her work usually is and of course there are definitely some lovely pops of color in here but it is very neat to see her play with some um, more neutral color schemes I love her edgings there's so many places to write but you're so inspired every page with just the little bits how beautiful and then getting to use some of the ephemera from other artists so much fun as well Look how pretty that dangle is flowers, the faux bird's nest, little notebook, lovely, so pretty. So this one is Trash to Treasure. Um, I think this is from her as well. Nope. This one's by Kathy Courtney. It's almost a similar style, but this is a different artist. This is uh, Kathy Courtney. It's called Living the Life. Look at that. I love this fabric. Isn't that gorgeous? That rich red. Two signatures. Beautiful collaged cover. Living the Life. And it honestly is a similar, just kind of eclectic collaged feel which I love I always think it's so fun I'm working on a boho type journal right now I would like to finish it this week however oh boy do I have a busy week this week um for sure so 
I have no idea how much extra time I'm going to have to get to anything. So we will see. But I am over halfway done with it and it is coming out lovely. Can't wait to show it to you. Look how pretty this is. Look at that. Just the gorgeous little bits. So much to it. Look at the gold paint. Ooh. Beautiful. Packaging paper. Oh, look at that. That is gorgeous. I love mixed media. I was playing around with texture paint in my uh, new journal. It's definitely fun. So this one is Kathy Courtney living the life. And then we have, I'm going to guess this one's back to Michelle because of the dyed paper, but I could be wrong. Oh, I'm wrong again. Oh my goodness. Oh, you know what? I messed up. This is from Kathy Courtney too. See, look, 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 look. Kathy Courtney. She used ephemera from Michelle Wynn. I just looked at the last name. Guys, it's early and my brain's not working. I was like, something's not right here. This style's too similar. So no, Kathy Courtney. This is all Kathy Courtney. <laughs> Sorry, Kathy. Sorry, Michelle. Um, obviously, I love both your work. So I'm getting confused here. Look at this guest check on the front. So pretty. Almost a little faux nest there with faux eggs. Look at the dyed fabric. Isn't that yummy? Ugh. And these beads. Oh, look, there's a little rabbit there and a little cat. So cute. This is called Grunge from the Heart. Book made from cardboard. Material is canvas that she dyed. And again, Kathy. These are Kathy's journals. I can tell we have some ephemera from, I think that's from Yvette. Gorgeous colors. Grunge from the heart. Little little women charm here. The little book charm. A lot of these pages are nice and thick. Also have coffee dyed. how pretty those little corrugated pockets are. Ooh, pretty flowers. Ooh, nice pocket page there. So gorgeous. Oh, can't get it back in. Whatever um, angle I film from, it's hard to check and untuck stuff. Pretty stamping. Little bag. Pretty, pretty. Look at that. Oh, so gorgeous. And our final one for today, I'm going to assume Kathy again, but you know, as wrong as I've been today. Dreams of beauty made from a cardboard box. Kathy Courtney. So you can feel it. That's really neat. Like you can feel this is nice and heavy. So she made it from a nice cardboard box, but it doesn't feel like a corrugated cardboard box. So that's really cool. Four signatures. Love the fabric. Dreams of beauty. Very similar in um, eclectic style to the other ones. Lots of ephemera and pockets and page edgings bits and pieces oh look at the little butterfly there some little butterflies in here too gorgeous trim little pages so cute so cute Owl. Look at that. That's 
gorgeous. Some of these, I think this is one of uh, Joanne's ephemera pieces. Oh, another little butterfly. We love when um, our customers buy ephemera and then use it in their journals. Oh, another butterfly. Look at that, how pretty that ribbon is and the bird stencil. It's just gorgeous. Look at that trim too, these boho trims. Little envelopes. Really pretty pages. Look at that stenciling. And there's a little baggie of ephemera in the back. So that's what's been added today. These four lovely journals from Kathy. Kathy, they're, they're just lovely. So, so pretty. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. I hope you'll give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. You'll subscribe if you have not and check back with me. Hopefully I'll have time this week for another video. I'd really love to get two more videos in this week. But like I said, crazy week. Next week is fall break and I would, my plan is to pretty much work the shop, um, creating things, videos every day uh, next week unless something else comes up, but that should be the plan. So it'll feel a little bit more normal um, and I really do hope that you'll enjoy next week and that you'll tune in to all of the videos and the journals and uh, maybe we'll even have some good sales next week. So have a wonderful day. I'll see you all later.